You know all those shows on the telly where people move away from the city to live here? Well, you can see why, can't you? Ah, the Offington White Horse. This thing's incredible. The first prehistoric display of horsepower. One. This is a lovely little village. I'd stop for a cup of tea and a cream bun every time if I could. But you're not winning any races that way. The Roman history of Britain is actually fascinating if you look into it. And if you do, maybe you could come and tell me some of it because I haven't got a clue. Beautiful spot. One of my favourites. I've camped on the bank so many times, I think even the fish are sick of me. Hang on. I'm sure I've seen this one in a film. Oh, a bunch of films. Don't remember that much about them, but I like the one with the flying car. Welcome to Edinburgh, greatest city in the world. Grab yourself some fish and chips, some salt and sauce, and make yourself at home. Nobody's really sure exactly which Arthur it's named after. I like to think he was just some guy who knew where to plonk his chair down for a good view. The Derwent Reservoir. There's actually a beautiful hiking trail that winds up through the forest and along the shoreline. Long walk though, so it's much faster if you do it in a jag.
Derwin Whitewater. Good for a shower if you've been out off-roading for a few nights. Trust me. The Moorhead Wind Farm. People say these things are loud and they ruin the landscape, but I think they're brilliant. Castle. I told Kira, if we're going to do Horizon in the UK, we have to make sure it's well defended from the sea.